King Charles wants the disgraced Prince Andrew to remarry Sarah Ferguson after the pair divorced in 1996 after having two daughters, Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie, but can the pair set their differences aside and reunite? King Charles, who is in his second year of reign, indicated he would provide the pair with his blessing but that the ceremony would be small and would take place at the All Saints Chapel, but at the moment, they don't see a rush to do so. They're on good terms and they have a good family dynamic so remarrying just risks complicating that, according to Victoria Arbiter, there's long been speculation regarding whether or not Andrew and Fergie will remarry. But the current situation seems to suit them both well so why complicate things? Most relationships become toxic once sealed with marriage. Fergie previously said they're the happiest divorced couple she knows so there's little to be gained by remarrying. They've always shown immense loyalty towards each other and clearly their relationship works exactly as it is. A further hiccup in the road would be Andrew's controversial connection to Jeffrey Epstein, Ghislaine Maxwell, and Virginia Dufresne, with the prince being accused of lying under oath and the sexual assault of a minor. The disgraced is currently depressed and has locked himself up in his inner chambers. It would cause outrage in the United Kingdom if such a figure was awarded a visible, state marriage like Prince William had back in 2011. Prince Andrew, Duke of York, and Sarah Ferguson, commonly known as Fergie, married on July 23, 1986, at Westminster Abbey in London and they had two daughters, Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie. The marriage was widely publicised and attracted significant attention. The couple's relationship had its highs and lows, with moments of public affection and controversy. However, their marriage faced challenges, including allegations of infidelity and strained relations with the royal family. In 1992, they announced their separation, and their divorce was finalised in 1996. Despite their divorce, Andrew and Sarah maintained a close relationship, often spending time together with their daughters. Over the years, they have continued to support each other publicly, attending family events and engagements together, showcasing an amicable post-divorce relationship. They even still live together at the Royal Lodge despite separating 27 years ago. Do you think Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson should remarry? Let us know what you think in the comments below. Also, subscribe to the Royal Diaries channel. Make sure you watch the video on Royal Diaries that shows how Prince William feels betrayed by King Charles.